So I guess there's a story going around of, I don't know, people, I guess protesters, ripping down uh, posters that are, uh, they're of missing people from when uh, Hamas attacked and captured some people. Um, yeah, I, I don't. I don't understand that. I don't understand it. Um, I don't know if these people are trying to say that they don't believe that these people were captured or if they just are so against Israel now that they just are like, fuck, fuck the hostages, fuck anyone that's Israeli. Like, I don't know. The people that are, are, are ripping these posters down, they... I get you're angry. I, even I'm angry. Even I'm siding with Hamas, and I don't even mean to. It's, it's sad, really. It's not something we should be doing, but at the same time, you can't help but side with them. And, yeah, I've done other videos. I have my own reasons why I side with them, but... I get if you're angry, but don't take your anger out onto those who are already hurting, especially those that have had people captured, missing, killed. Uh, these people are hurting, but they're still screaming out ceasefire. They want the bloodshed to stop. They don't want Netanyahu to be doing what he's doing because of like in the name of their their loved ones like he, they don't want that they don't want any of this you guys need to direct your anger where it needs to be which is at, at the right wing government of Israel you need to remove Netanyahu even if it's by force protest as much as you can but when it comes down to it you need to remove him by any means necessary, or else World War III is all Israel's fault, with a dash of American fault. So, please, just, I, I don't know what else to say, just don't attack people that don't need to be attacked, that are going through the same pain as you, that feel just as bad as you. You need to put your anger towards the people that it actually deserves to go towards, which is the governments. Not just Israel, America as well. <sighs> Call them out. Call out the, all the government, all the leaders, everyone. Call out UN even. You would think that they would have stepped in by now, and they haven't. I don't know what else to say. People just really, really need to... I don't know, maybe... Go off and be by themselves when they're feeling full of anger, full of rage. Or maybe use it in a productive way somehow. You want to speak up, you want to shout out. Maybe write some things down on posters and bring it to people at protests. Help them out. Bring protesters water, food. I mean, depending on what state you're in in America, it's fucking illegal, apparently. You know, freedom. Freedom in Texas and all. Blah, blah, crap. But yeah, if you're in Israel and you're, you're ripping down these, these posters, I, I, I don't know what to say. You gotta focus your anger on Netanyahu, not the people. They are they are being manipulated. You have to think of this as, and I know this is really hard, but you have to think of it literally just like Nazi Germany. Hitler manipulated people, used propaganda, he got it to where... So some people believed him. 
even though that wasn't what they wanted or necessarily, you know, wanted to do or believe in, but they followed him. For what reasons? I, I don't really know. Maybe they did believe in it, but you can't just assume everyone wants this horrible shit to happen. So, try and focus your anger on Netanyahu where it needs to be.